Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Nathaniel Santiago. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you, you may all be seated. Today is Friday, January 10th, 2020. Now let's go to the to see what happened today in history. Thank you, Nathaniel. Today in history, on January 10th, 1861, Florida secedes from the Union. Now let's go to Amari to see what's for lunch. Thank you, Danielle. Today for lunch, we have cheese pizza, crispy chicken patty, romaine salad, cucumber coins, mixed fruit cups, and your choice of milk. Bon appetit. Now let's go back to Nathaniel. Thank you, Mari. That sounds delicious. In school news, the Yankee candle sales are still ongoing to sell those candles. Also, next Thursday is family night. Now let's go to Weather with Ernst. Thank you, Nathaniel. Today's weather in Pembroke Pines, Florida is forecast to be 80 degrees Fahrenheit and cloudy. Now let's go back to Nathaniel. Now let's go to Let's Talk with Isabel. Welcome to Let's Talk. I'm Isabel Montes. Today we have Ms. Belholm who is going to explain to us what is a CRT teacher. So what does CRT stand for? A CRT stands for Curriculum Resource Teacher. What does a Curriculum Resource Teacher do? We do a little bit of everything. We um, get together assessments. We get, um, we help with whatever support the teachers need in the classroom. That's where we would come in. Uh, what do you enjoy about doing this job? I enjoy actually um, learning myself because sometimes you have to research and find answers. And also just assisting teachers, assisting the students, assisting wherever it's needed. If you could have one superpower, what would it be? I would have a Wakandian power, straight from Wakanda. Black Panther. Black Panther, Wakanda forever. <laughs> What are three words you would use to describe yourself? Intelligent. Um, reflective. And I want to say thoughtful. Okay, now it's time for a lightning round. What's your favorite number? Seven. Toy Story or Aladdin? Definitely Aladdin. Favorite sport? Gymnastics. Pizza or pasta? Neither. A good hamburger hits the spot. Coke or Pepsi? An ice cold Pepsi. It has to be ice cold. That's refreshing. And a dog or cat? Puppy and a kitten. I don't like dogs and I don't like cats, but I like puppies and I like kittens. Thank you, Ms. Boho, You're for welcome. taking your time to sit down with us. Thank you for having me. I know I'm complicated. <laughs> Thank you, Isabel. Patriots, don't forget your past expectations. It represents, present yourself positively, act kindly toward others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats, Ms. Cavalita, Ms. Body, Ms. Santi Esteban, Ms. Vasquez, Ms. Jimenez, Ms. Kane, and Mr. Santiago. You got the correct answer to the trivia question, which was, Whose nose grew longer every time he lied? The correct answer was Pinocchio. Now for today's trivia. What fruit do kids traditionally give to their teachers? Repeat, what fruit do kids traditionally give to their teachers? Teachers, 
Send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a fantastic Friday. And remember, reset your mindset. Have a great day.